Schizophrenia is a, uh, a disorder that is frequently uh, just devastating for patients and, and families and takes a, a huge toll on, on society uh, a, as a whole, both in terms of economic cost, but uh, just um, the idea of uh, people really struggling and uh, doing so on a chronic basis uh, for something that uh, hopefully um, we can understand better and ultimately uh, help treat. So the angle that we're taking is to look at folic acid, which is a B vitamin that's found in the diet. Um, there's some uh, evidence that it is important for people who have the illness. We've done a few clinical trials now showing that there's some um, uh, modest benefit in symptom improvement. Um, but the big question is whether earlier exposure to folic acid may have even more of an impact and could even in some cases be a, a preventative kind of intervention and that's something that in schizophrenia and psychiatry again in general we're really sorely lacking. So what we're studying is whether very early exposure to folic acid in particular during early brain development even during uh, gestation during pregnancy may um, make a difference in terms of uh, reducing someone's risk for developing schizophrenia for particularly for people who might be at a higher level of risk because of uh, their, their genetic background or other kinds of risk factors.